good afternoon and welcome to the ESOL department over at Doncaster College. My name is Naomi Nakata and I am the Student Experience Lead over at The Hub. Today I want to tell you a little bit about ESOL, which is English for Speakers of Other Languages. So if English is not your first language, this course and the range of courses we have may be suitable for you. Over here we have over 80 different ESOL courses running. We run a range of adult provision where stu students come in on a part-time basis as well as running four study programmes for 16 to 19 year olds. So I'm going to start by telling you a little bit about the study programmes and then I'll move on to the adult provision. So if you are in your final year at school and you are considering what your next steps are, you may need to improve your English and math skills before you can go on to, for example, a hairdressing course, a motor vehicle course, or any of the wide range of courses we have here. ESOL acts as a stepping stone to help you improve your English skills so that you can access other provision. So on the ESOL study programme, if you were 16 to 19, this course would run over three days a week. It would be classed as a full-time course. This year, classes are running Mondays, Tuesdays and Wednesdays. And we have four different levels. So we have entry one, where students might have very, very low English. Entry two, entry three and level one. Once students have progressed through entry three or level one, they're normally ready to access another programme across college or go into sixth form. So what do you do on a study programme at Doncaster College? You would do your ESOL qualification at whatever level um, you were classed as working towards when you first came for your initial assessment and your interview. Um, so you would do that for eight hours a week. And then you would also do functional skills maths or GCC maths. So you're going to do an ESOL qualification, which will do uh, improve your speaking, listening, reading and writing, functional skills maths or GCSE maths. And then alongside that, we do things like some work experience where you will get the chance to go out on a placement. We will do Skills Boost Weekly, which gets you employment ready. And we will have tutorials and some enrichment as well. So students get the opportunity to go on a range of trips. So, for example, this year, uh, students have been to visit Old Trafford, um, the football ground. They've been to the Yorkshire Wildlife Park. They've had some trips to the cinema. And most recently, they went to visit the Houses of Parliament. Um, so if you're interested in doing one of these courses, please complete the online application form on the website. You'll see the links at the bottom of this event. Over to the adult provision then, we have about a thousand learners enrolled in ESOL adult provision as well. So over 80 courses. These courses run for seven weeks, 12 weeks or 18 weeks. And we have start dates running from various times in the year. So September, January, March and April are the usual ones. Students will uh, complete an application form. They'll then be invited in for an initial assessment and interview. And we'll talk to them about what's the right programme for them. So we have some courses that focus on improving your speaking and listening skills. We have some courses that focus on improving your reading, some courses that focus on improving your writing. And these are all NOCN Skills for Life qualifications. And then we also have Functional Skills English qualifications, which will improve your speaking, listening, reading and writing. So we have very, very high achievement rates over in the ESOL department. We are classed as an outstanding department with um, a pass rate of 96% for the last couple of years. 
Uh, the staff are very well experienced and very helpful and will do everything they can to help you progress and then move on to other FE, further education courses. Um, we have a lot of students that move on to higher education or GCSEs. So some people go back to work and get a promotion within their work. So lots of different progression routes for you. Um, it's a fun place to learn and uh, students normally come to us and stay with us for a couple of years while they uh, pass all their exams. Okay, so if you want to find out any more information, please email us at the college and someone will help you. Look forward to seeing you soon. Bye bye from all the team at ESOL.